Okay, so hi everyone. Uh, I hope my screen is visible. So today we are going to uh, know about a newly launched product of Go Charting, and this uh, tool it's called Options Scalper. Okay, so what you have to do is you have to go to GoCharting.com homepage, and then go to Products, and then click on Options Scalper. Right. So now uh, the first question is why do we need this tool? Okay, so see what is the problem when we are trading options in indian market first of all nse does not allow a uh, bracket order on options so bracket order means the target price and stop loss order at one go so that is not allowed by nse now second thing also brokers are not allowing okay so this was the problem but if you talk about the forex market uh, or even if you talk about the indian stock market that is if you are trading in stocks that is easily available the brackets orders are available but not for options now options if you see that options prices are changing you know very fast and also your pnl uh, you know it matters a lot in just few uh, small moments or your pnl moves you know in a big way and then there are many guys who are uh, taking advantage of scalping in options. Also, if you see by launch of our order flow charts, the scalping has become easier because you guys know, uh, you, you know, you guys are taking the webinar since last two to three months and you know how these big orders nodes, they are working. If, if the price goes at those levels, they represent a very good opportunity for scalping. Okay so for that there was actually no tool till now okay so what we have done is we have uh, brought a new tool it's called option scalper so let me give you the features one by one so first of all this is available for nse bsc that is bsc fnol uh, sensex bank x and also for mcx so right now it's five o'clock so we'll be uh, trying it on crude oil okay so this is crude oil. So let me just, when you search crude oil, now you see that on the left hand side, the call option appear on the right hand side, the put option appear. And in the middle, you will find that you can see this continuous futures as well as the monthly futures. So you can also trade the futures, the option, call option and the put option. So these three are very clear to you. Now you can choose the expiry date. You can choose the strikes. Okay. You can also see uh, the chain. So if you click click on that, you will see the option chain. You can adjust the uh, you know uh, strike prices based on you want to trade it in ATM, OTM, or ITM. Okay, ITM two, ITM three, or so. Right now we'll keep it at ATM. You can fix the number of lots, product type, order type, and then now these three things are very important. That is predefined SL target and uh, trailing loss, trailing SL. So for example, I keep it five. So these two orders will go with your main order. Okay. Now let's try to place some order. So I'll just click buy now. And now you see that these eight lots have been traded. So right now it is in paper trading mode. So let me just come here, guys. If you click on connect broker, these are the list of brokers. As of now, we are going to add more and more brokers very, very, very soon. Now, suppose uh, you are not adding any broker. So this will go into paper trading mode automatically. And now you see, see what was uh, the average price? It is 131. And based on this price, if you see the target, okay, so add 13 to it. So you will get 144 and subtract 11 from it and you will get 120. So TP and SL is set already. Now you can also change these TP and SL by these plus minus button, okay? You can just simply press this exit button or you can exit 10%, 25%, 50% or you can simply reverse your position, okay? We are not stopping here. You can go to the setting option and you can set the PNL based on the entire position. So for example, I can also buy puts Okay, now the MPM will be based on these two positions. So for the particular position, we have this TP and SL, but what about the entire position? So you can set the TP and SL for entire position, also the trailing stop loss, okay? So once it is triggered, your all positions that is call and put, everything will be exited, okay?
So I hope this feature is clear. Then you can also go and place limit order. Now here, guys, uh, this is actually, you will understand it's important. Trust me, this is a very, very good tool. See, I already told how to place the market order. Now you can also place the limit order. Okay, so for example, this is the right now the price is 130. You can place a limit order at 110. Okay, now this order will actually go to order book here. Okay, so you can see this order is open. Price is 110 and take profit is 123 and stop loss is 99. So it will go with the bracket order. Okay, so the limit order will go with the bracket order. After that, you can also place, there are many traders who, you know, love to trade based on breakout or breakdown. So for example, your breakout level is 133 in this case. And now you want to buy this product when it reaches 134. So what you can do, you can put the stop limit order of 134. Okay. And here it will be again, just put 133.9 or something like that. Uh, okay. And uh, then what will happen that this order will be executed once this breaks out with bracket order. Okay. So see the beauty of this tool. Okay. So breakout trading or breakdown trading, limit buying, market buying with bracket order, this has made possible. Now we are not stopping here, guys. This was the feature of this grid tab. If you go to chart tab, okay now you see now you see here you can actually manage your positions by simply sliding okay so here i think there is a limit order this is a limit order we are having okay this one is limit order okay can you see this limit order is pending so why this limit order is pending because uh, in the order book there is this limit order is open okay so let me close this limit order first of all okay limit order no, no, not this, this one. Okay. And now we have this order, which is running. Okay. So you can actually manage this order simple. You know, you can see this is simply, if, if it, it goes up in your direction, you can simply slide it, keep on sliding. And for even for, you can do that for target price. Okay. This is so simple. Then suppose you are not trading in put, but you are trading in call. You can simply toggle it, make it a bigger version and go to chart types now here comes the magic just apply the imbalance you guys see this is so beautiful you can see your order flow charts your positions are running here okay you can manage your positions by looking at order flow for options okay so uh, i mean what do you else what else do you want guys and then just go to study you can add your favorite indicators like delta bars and then you can also add the bar statistics okay bar statistics so these everything can be added you can right click and you have these options so you can also now see uh, and it is not uh, needed that you have to go to grid to place order every time just simply come to chart i think i like this feature much better simply come to chart now here in the bottom you just select you say select your script here from here nifty sensex bank x whatever then you set your lots expiry from here strike adjustment predefined sl and target here and trailing sl and simply go buy sell now uh, there is one more thing suppose the price is here now you want to place a limit buy order you can simply go and you know place your mouse below the ltp and you will get option of buy limit sell stop sell stop limit but if you place your cursor above the ltp you will get sell limit buy stop so you can simply you know place sell limit order okay see so this is a limit sell order has been placed okay you can again place the buy limit order so this buy limit See this buy limit order is placed with your, you know, uh, bracket orders. Okay, it is going with the bracket order. That is important. So right now it is in under paper trading mode. So you can see some differences because it's a simulated environment. Okay, but when you are trading with the brokers, the exact orders are going to be placed. Okay. Yes. Okay. 
then uh, we also have this depth okay so we can go to depth and we can also place the order from here like if you just simply click over here it will place the limit by order and if you right click it will place the stop limit order okay so that same can be done for the put call you can also adjust these everything here in the depth also okay so i think uh, this completes the uh, overview now one uh, important thing is that this window has to be opened okay why because these orders are pending with us and this window has to be opened to these bracket orders actually work okay so that is point number one this is important thing to understand you cannot uh, say that okay i have put the bracket order and let me close my system let me close this window and uh, let me go for some work or tea or coffee no it cannot happen like that this has to be opened and internet connectivity should be good okay uh then we also have a kill switch okay then we also have a kill switch guys okay so uh, yeah so kill switch is i think uh, yeah this this is a kill switch so you can just uh, click on the kill switch and uh, you will not be able to trade for the entire day okay so i mean these are the important features of the scalper uh, tool uh, now i think i'm going to hand it over to nikhil if you guys have any question i'm here otherwise then nikhil can uh, go with his uh, daily market analysis just once